Hello beautiful people, my name is Amanda Zitto. I am currently halfway through my 8,000 mile loop of the United States that I have dubbed Flight of the Magpie. If you missed any of the episodes of me getting ready for this trip, I'll link the playlist above my head. I will be making nice polished episodes for you of this trip once I get back. Until then, I have these very informal, rough updates for you from the road. It is currently Wednesday, September 2nd, last night. I made it to the Atlantic Ocean, which is a pretty big deal. It's, it's, a, it's a big deal. It's, it's a big deal. <laughs> I am currently on the Outer Banks of North Carolina. I am officially starting to head inland from here and then back to Oregon. <laughs> I need to do in like eight days what it took me to do in like 11. It's fine. A couple more updates from the last time that I talked to you guys. I got to meet Her Two Wheels, which is super awesome. We did a video together on her channel. If you want to go watch that, I'll link it above and or down in the description, whichever is easiest for me at the point when I upload this. <laughs> After I split with Jess, I camped again, finally, in West Virginia. I thought that I had like the best campsite ever. I set up in the daylight. I got to eat before it was dark. It was like primo and about 6 a.m. it started pouring and my campsite flooded. <laughs> so I sacrificed the better part of a day in a hotel in Stanton, Virginia to try to dry everything out. I have a new rear tire. It's the Michelin Anarchy. Um, so far so good. Um, huge shout out to Motor Richmond for getting that tire on for me. They were amazing, super fast, and just amazing customer service. Thank you, Joe, for recommending them. I, I still haven't quite wrapped my head around the fact that I am like on the clear other side of the country like literally went from ocean to ocean like all the way across the United States and my brain hasn't really uh, wrapped around that yet <laughs> when I think about it I'm like oh no I'm just a couple of days away from home I'm, I'm not though I'm I'm quite far away from home <laughs> and uh, it's been very um, one extreme or the other. I'm either freezing and wet or it is really hot and very humid. There is a layer of sweat on me that I haven't been able to get off since I hit Virginia a couple days ago. I miss, uh, I miss the dry heat. The Outer Banks definitely feels like a hella tourist trap so it makes me kind of wonder what like mainland North Carolina coast is like if, if it is also just like non-stop businesses and houses all along the coast and only like a couple places where there's public access to the beach there is also Atlantic Ocean in my boots there will probably be sand from the Atlantic Ocean in my boots for a very long time now <laughs> when I got to see the ocean last night I got excited and want to get one of those like oh look the water is touching my boots kind of things and well the water went over my boots <laughs> I don't know what else I was expecting. <laughs> anyway, you guys, I wanted to keep this short and sweet, let you know that I made it to the East Coast. I saw the ocean. It feels so good. And I'm heading back westward now, which is very exciting. I'm stoked to be home again. I'm not gonna lie, I miss my bed <laughs> and my boyfriend. <laughs> but it feels so good to be on the road right now. It really does. And uh, yeah, if you would like to get early access to videos like these, you can become a patron for as little as $1 a month and get ad-free access to videos like these, including when I start making the nice polished episodes. Um, all of my patrons will get those at least a week earlier than what they're published on YouTube. Um, if you want to donate to my gas fund right now, I will leave links to my Ko-fi down in the description. Yeah, <laughs> I think that's it. I'll see you guys later. <laughs> Oh, question for my end screen crew. Okay, <laughs> bye.